Sure. Exactly, it looks great on this side. It's just a low car and there's a steep drop off on the barn there. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I've been standing around outside. It's uh, it's sunny, but it's still, you know, I'm just wearing an insulated shirt, not a jacket. And I just realized it's a heated steering wheel. It feels so good. Sophie, what do you think of the car so far? It's cool. She says it's cool. We got this cool steering wheel right here. The Opal steering wheel. So nice and warm. Okay, here we go. Here is my new Chevy Volt. Well, new to me. It is a 2012 model year. Um, and I got a great deal on it. But the reason why I got a great deal was because a deer hit the car. And if we look over here... Um, the driver's side door has to be open from the inside because the handle here doesn't work on the outside. And the back door really messed up, including uh, this just piece of plexiglass. Uh, the, the window got smashed. This is all messed up right here. So these doors will have to be replaced. I'm going to replace this driver's seat with one from a different car that I'm also going to use to replace those two doors there. Okay, here we are. We are taking the new to me 2012 Chevy Volt to the automatic car wash. And why I'm here is because, hey, uh, the door is being banged up on this car. I don't even know how well they seal. So I'm going to be a little crazy here. The car is dirty. We have all the salt on the roads and everything. The car needs to be washed anyway. So I figured I'd check to see if this leaks or not by running it through the car wash. It's the big blower to dry the car off. I'm just going around, uh, get into the back to see if there's any leaks or anything. Oh, <laughs> broken window glass. Good, I glad I found that with my fingers. No, good seal all the way around. Uh, plexiglass, duct tape, and the door, even as smashed up as it is, seals up real nice. Should I have borrowed the car and taken it through a car wash before I bought it? Probably, but uh, seems like a good deal on the car, and I still got work to do fixing up those doors, but uh, I'm having fun with it so far. I mean, I can stick my finger right behind there, but uh, it's still sealed up nice. So that's what it looks like now that it's clean. Looks a lot nicer, pretty good looking car. I've got lots more videos coming out about fixing up this car, so make sure you hit subscribe and the little notification bell. And also check out all my other electric vehicle projects right here on this YouTube channel. And come check us out at 300mpg.org.